listen, if it has been a long day for me, all right, which it's been a long day for me, if it is like 90 degrees out or 100 degrees out, which it is like 90 degrees out here and fucking like the humidity is just fucking ridiculous. Do me a fucking favor. If you're a stupid bitch that has never ever in your life been to a Starbucks apparently, why go through the drive through just to piss me and everybody else behind me off? Uh, these kind of, uh, so Debbie Dumbfuck decides to drive up through the drive through to Starbucks. I'm sitting there, one car in front of me, thinking, no big deal. Usually there's like 20. It's a big thing. I'm like, I'm just going to give it a little drink. I'll be on my way. No, Debbie Dumbfuck decides to pull up and go, okay, hi, hi, because she wants the fucking Starbucks drive through operating machine to be her friend. Say, hey, hey, how are you doing? God, you look swell. Did you lose weight? I don't know what the fuck she went. So finally the guy's like, um, yeah, can I help you with your order? Hi! Bitch, he's not gonna ask you what your sign is. Fucking move on. So then I hear her do this shit. Okay, I want the mocha chai, like, latte. What is that? Does it have... Wait, 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 no, no, no. Can I get it with 1%? Do you have 1% milk? This is the part where I'm literally just bashing my head into the steering wheel behind her. She just probably thinks I'm epileptic having a seizure. No, that's what I want to do to her fucking barren head. So then she goes like this. The guy's like, well, yeah, we've got uh, 1%, 2%. We got a whole milk if you need it, all that. Okay. Okay. Um, Is it the drink, the one I'm ordering, because it's got like the foam on top? I'll give you some foam on top. Fucking open your mouth. I'll put it right. I'll, I'll give you plenty of foam. Show me your breasts. I'll give you, I'll, I'll get out the car right now and give you foam is galore. And then she starts doing this number. Uh, no, I mean, okay. I don't know if I want that one. Okay. Um, but is it, okay. Is it hot or can I get it iced? At that point, if I worked at that fucking Starbucks, my, I would have been fired. Cause my answer would have been neither. <laughs> we don't have hot drinks or ice drinks. We just have lukewarm drinks that's all we have we didn't even know people did ice drinks or hot drinks that's fucking weird where do you go i gotta start going to that coffee place she starts asking a thousand more questions you see me behind you you see me doing this shit and like hurry the I, finally i had the window open because it was so fucking hot i'm like jesus fucking christ bitch hurry the fuck up and order what you're gonna order i don't know if she heard me i'm just pretending not to hear me because then she asked the question she wanted something to eat we already got through that two hour drink order, but now she sees there's food there and she's, you know, got two brain cells and they're confused. So she's like, oh, is there like, a, is breakfast like a sausage? I think it's a sausage biscuit I'm seeing. I don't know, is this either a sausage biscuit or it's a homeless guy? I don't know, I'm not sure. I get them confused all the time. Um, Do they have that like all day? Is that like a breakfast thing? Like, it, but it's all day or is it just breakfast? How does she insert a tampon? Somebody tell me. I want to see her redirection to a fucking tampon right now. Okay, remove the packaging shit. That's what I never did. That's why I always get cut there. I always thought it wasn't working right. Remove the packaging, okay? Like, don't put the whole thing up there, all right? Use the cotton, the string part. I use it as an earring. I think I'll just go like this when I start bleeding really heavily and kind of use my yoga and just kind of like, you know, put my underpants out and just kind of suck it up with the cotton and just maybe shake it off. And then it's just like a really cool look because I've got like a red earring. <laughs> I'm pretty, but nothing's gonna happen for me after 30. <laughs> now it's all downhill. <laughs> I'm gonna be a mistress, a mistress, and then a fucking facelift that's just horrifying. And that's about it. And in, in a nursing home, or probably a shotgun to my head. I just had to share because I'm just annoyed and why not share? Fucking shit, I swear to Christ.